Hey everybody, what's going on? Hello! How's it going? The sign is still... The sign could use a little more, um, some better batteries to get it a little bit brighter. I thought that we could open one of these boxes. Because remember when I said I was going to spend all three days cleaning my room? My, well, my room, the hall, my bathroom, everything during this three-day holiday weekend. Happy Labor Day weekend to those of you in the States who are celebrating it. Anywho, uh, I didn't know that I was going to have like chills and it was going to feel like it was 32 degrees in my blood and just this real tired feeling. And I don't know, I can't put my finger on it, but I just, boy, I feel bad. Headache. Now, I took a test and it came out negative. So I don't know what it is, but speaking of not feeling great and me actually having no place to bitch about it, uh, think about, um, please, on the channel Mimi's Life, Diane, she's in the hospital. They found, or is it Diana? Diana or Diana. I always get that, her name confused, but I know her channel is Mimi's Life. Or is it, it's Mimi's Life? Oh, no. Well, you know what I mean. Mimi's life. Mimi, we love her. They found a mass in one of her lungs. And so she's in the hospital getting that looked at. So please keep her in your thoughts and prayers if you pray. And I know that sounds cliche, but uh, meaning thoughts and prayer, thoughts and prayers. But really, please keep her in your thoughts and prayers. And also, everyone, I get a lot of comments with every video with people asking me how Cheryl is doing or if I've heard from her lately, Cheryl from Tr a Tranquil Life channel. She, you can find her now over on a channel called Are We There Yet? My cat is, Loki is just off the hook today. I'm sorry. And I'm going to link to her channel, Are We There Yet? Uh, well, it's not her channel. She shares it with her husband, but I'm going to link to that in the comments below. I'm going to pin it and also in my description. All right, that's my business. Those are my housekeeping items. Isn't that what they call them? I should know in long business meetings. Let's get some housekeeping items out of the way first. No, but really though, Mimi, it's Mimi or Mimi's life and then... I'm worried about her, and I was remiss in not mentioning her yesterday, but I'm sorry about that. I'm trying to get this box open to some way that I can pull things out. Now, Loki is extremely hyper. Loki is my kitten. If you're new to my channel, hi. And he is wrecking and trashing everything, and every time I think I've got something cat-proofed, he just knocks, he gets up there and knocks it over again, and or not find something new to knock over. And then that thing that's frustrating is he'll purr loudly the whole time while he's destroying something. So I don't know, you guys. He's on the floor right now chasing a ball. And maybe he'll, maybe he'll conk out in a minute. Okay, the first thing in this box. Stop nattering on. That's my latest favorite comment. Stop nattering on. Someone left a comment yesterday saying, I natter on too much. I'm assuming that person is from across the pond. I've never used the word natter in my life until now. So that's kind of cool. But she said, try to be more like that cheap chick. The cheap chick or cheap chick. I've, I think I've only watched her channel a few times. It's a good channel, but sure, let me just go copy some other YouTuber style. That seems about right. And if you notice my nails, these are the nails that I hauled yesterday from Timu. Now, they've already popped off a couple of times and I just glued them on. So, I don't know what makes those Olive in June from Walgreens stay on for so long so beautifully, but the Timu ones will come off if I just touch the air. But I've got my nail glue here. I'm ready if another one pops off. I predict that at least one nail will come off during this video. Okay, I'm gonna stop nattering on. All right, the first thing in this huge box, 
I got another one of these. I bought the huge one because I'm, yeah, I'm going to say it because I'm an idiot like that. Well, I didn't know at the time when I bought this huge rug that looks like a cassette tape. Let me open it up. That it was just going to be a giant piece of foam with a cassette tape printed on it. I thought, Loki, what are you doing? Oh. I thought when they said rug, they meant rug, rug. But no, it's just foam with, oh my gosh, I got the biggest size. Oh, and I forgot to call up my, help me. How do you even get this? All right, so it looks like this. There it is. And you know where it's going to go? It's going to go on the bottom of Loki's playpen. On the floor of his playpen that he still sleeps in at night. Because, oh lord. Alright, how much did I pay for that ridiculous thing? I want my money back. I'm going to try it. But then if they tell me to mail that thing, I'm going to say never mind. But I'm going to be like, this is foam, not a rug. The description should, should say giant piece of foam. The end. I'm See, I'm mad. I'm mad on the internet again. Just stop buying junk from Timu and to quote somebody else and my life will be much happier. Okay, hold up a minute while I find the order. Must find order. Oh, I screwed up. Oh, Lord, it's going to be one of those days. How have you guys been doing? I've been doing okay, not feeling well, as you know, wah, 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 all that. And I hate it when I don't have the order already pulled up, but I, in my defense, I didn't know what it was. Okay, stop it. My phone is being all... Okay, I, whatever it was, it was a lot. It was a lot. It's not in this order. There's the cat jumping. Oh, there it is. It was... <sighs> I paid $15.48 for that thing. That's crazy. Heck yes, I'm going to ask for a refund. Okay, we found the order. Oh, there's a cat hair in my nose. What else is in here? Okay. There's still a cat hair in my nose. You ha like if you have pets, do you guys ever get that, you know, cat hair in your nose and then you can feel it waving around in the breeze when you breathe? It's an annoying feeling. What is this? Let me just get this big scary scissors. You're gonna poke your eye out. Gonna poke my eye out one day. I'll upload it. I need those views. Oh, these are beautiful flowers. Now, unlike the usual artificial flowers that come in the Timu sends, uh-oh, here comes a little tiny. They didn't come in a box. They came on long stems, so I need to figure out kind of if I'm going to put these in a tall vase or if I'm going to pull them off because I had this vision of love, but also of putting them in this. I have it right here because putting them in this, this vase, some of them with the gold chain. Now this flower arrangement got destroyed again this morning back here with these gold chains hanging off this black flower vase. I don't know, you guys. I don't know. So many creative thoughts and ideas with Timu stuff. Who knows? Throw that over there. Okay, well, these are really pretty. And wow, I barely have enough room to move an arm. Um, so yeah, I know I was going to do an infomercial for this next video, but I just wanted to open some of these Timu boxes. 
get them put away and out of my life. And the beautiful, those are 13 forks of silk peonies and they were $8.48 and they are still, now they are $8.99. Well, wait, well, you can get them in different colors. I don't know if the price changes with the colors. Okay, what else is in here? Oh dear, it's another light up sign for the back. Oh, this isn't even in this order. It's the letter E. Yeah. You know how I know? Because on the back, the e, there's a check mark by E. Just in case I forget what my name starts with. A lot of people don't even know my name. When I, I would have preferred to just keep my name and identity. Like just, well, my identity. Yeah, probably that'll get. Oops, I totally missed the bag. Um, the name, my name. I didn't really want people to know my name at all. Not even my first name. But it's, you're never going to win with that goal on YouTube. So my name is Erin, but please don't use it in comments or call me or Just call me, hey, everybody, please. I can't tell which way is right side on the camera or not, but it's an, it's the letter E. When you light it up, it's pink. It takes batteries or you can plug it in a USB charger. And of course, it's in a different order. But if you too would like your initial in a neon sign, it is $7.98 and they are still available. And the most popular letter, in case you were wondering, is the letter A because that has a little fire emoji by it. Gosh, so many A's out there wanting their name in neon lights. Okay. What is this? This is going in the trash. I made it. This is something really stupid. Um, you prop up your diamond painting. I thought this was when I ordered it a light board for diamond paint da diamond painting but it's really just a stand to prop up whatever on I mean you could prop up your diamond painting on this there are no lights I don't know what you could lean your your um tablet against it or you could throw it away that infuriates people, huh? When I buy things and say, I'm just going to, you could donate it. Okay, there you go. Just joking, you guys. I would, well, I'm not going to say I would never, but no, I wouldn't just chuck something in the trash. It's not in this order. Well, nobody cares how much that thing costs anyway. When we find it in another order, I'll tell you how much it costs, but it's just a little stand and I will try my best to link to my orders in the description below but sometimes when you copy the link and then you paste it Timu just puts timu.com and won't let me share the order but if there's ever anything that you want just let me know and I'll give you the link oh my word it's another bag now this is a dupe of a oops never mind it's just a bag just a bag, only a bag, not a dupe of anything, it's just a bag. I don't know, I saw it on Amber, that girl's channel, and I liked it at the time. I thought it would look cute with jeans and all my stuff in it. It's too big for my mom before everybody goes, give it to your mom. My, my tripod is completely falling down. Is it in the frame? Okay, as long as it's not in the frame, I don't care. My light tripod, my professional fill light. Okay, Loki is inside of that foam mat because it fell on the, I put it down on the ground, rolled up. Oops. All right, put this right here. Let's take a look at this bag. 
which was, let me hold it up. Oh, somebody remind me to take a thumbnail with something. All right. It was $28.88. Oh, no. That's expensive. Is it still around? Now it's $36.98. So that's crazy, Timu, raising your prices like that. Maybe I had a coupon for $10 off of it or something. I don't know. Inside, it's got a... It's got... Okay, it's got a... Oh, it stinks. It's got a strap that matches my nails. And it has three compartments inside. One, two, three. And they're separated by this middle zippered compartment. It's got a zippered bag. It's got slip pockets. I mean, it's got a zippered pocket here. It's got slip pockets here. Just kind of your typical purse. It would have been nice if they would have stuffed it with paper. But God forbid, just so it could keep a shape um the crocodile print it is raised but it's also very printed looking so i mean you're not going to fool anyone with your genuine crocodile print purse or anything like that it's got a little thing that hangs down okay that's cute and then this side is this side. I don't know how I feel about it, you guys. I can't tell how I feel about anything right now because I don't, I'm not feeling very good. So I don't know. Like if something truly delights me, I guess we'll know. More diamond paintings. Oh my word. This diamond painting looks like, let me see if I can find it so I can show you what it looks like. Do you hear that cat climbing in things, climbing in things, getting ready to knock over things? Loki, what are you doing? Someone asked me how old Loki is now. I think he's about four months. This diamond painting isn't in this order, so I'm going to save it and show, show it to you in a minute. Here's another diamond painting, and I should say diamond painting kits, and because they come with the beads, the tool... A little tray, the wax that you use, or whatever you call it, to stick your little beads on your thing. Still not in that order. Okay, let me move to another order then, for Pete's sake. I hate it when Timu puts a bunch of orders in one box. Okay, I got, because I thought it would be fun, I got a... Okay, here's the first diamond painting that... I was looking for... Now stop it, Timu. Why do they want to do that? It's just a girl with wild hair in a field of bleak-looking flowers and eyes in her hair. Eyes in her hair? Peacock feathers in her hair? I don't know. I just liked it. I liked the aesthetic of it. I thought it was nice. It's not going to be very colorful, though. It's going to be a lot of grays and blacks with some spots of red. That's cool. And then next, another diamond painting I got. Now, y'all know we're never going to finish any of these. Is, please be in this order. I do also kind of like those. No, I like people who talk during their hauls. I got Marilyn Monroe, too. And she was, and that's what this thing is. She is she is right now four dollars and nineteen cents. I paid three seventy seven for her, and for the other one that I just showed you, it I paid three fifty nine, and it is now three ninety eight. Wow, Timu inching their prices up bit by bit. No wonder I'm not getting very many price adjustments these days. Are you guys getting very many price adjustments these days? All right, now I see something from another... Well, let's see what this box is. I should slow down. 19 minutes. Everybody always likes the long hauls. They're in it for the long haul. This is another baseball cap rack. I would take my hat off and show you how it works, but... You get the idea. Ooh, my hat. 
Do I have another hat on my bed? I do have another hat on my bed. I've got to change these sheets today, which means taking everything off my bed. Where a man should be, there's a lot of Timu stuff. That seems appropriate. Like a man would sleep here, but instead I have Timu stuff. That just seems so symbolic of my life. All right, you put your hat on the little hook like this. That's how my mom talks. That's her voice. That's my mom's voice. And it hangs. Okay, and it's got, it's, it's adhesive. Let's see how well that sticks. All right, I'll stop talking like her. It's stainless steel. I don't know if it's stainless steel or not. It is. Oh, okay. So that stand, that worthless adjustable. See, it says adjustable light box laptop pad stand. But there's nothing about it that lights up. But it was $8.29 and it's now $9.27. And then that baseball cap stand stainless steel baseball cap stand i paid 479 and it's now 449 okay there you go did i i wait i where's my price adjustment timu i'll get it tomorrow probably all right let's take a oops let's take a break for a monster it's just a monster Thank you. It's not a mysterious red solo cup this time. All right. Nails. Perfect. I got some Christmas nails with little snowmen on them. And some Dia de los Muertos. That was bad. Day of the Dead. Nails, those are cute. I really like those a lot. I'm excited about those. In fact, if I would have got, if I would have known, I would have put those on today. What did I pay? I pay for the blah, blah. What did I pay for those nails? One ninety eight. I'm guessing because aren't they all one ninety eight? They're not in this order. Of course, they're not in this order. Is there anything in this order before I jog on and try to find them? Go back over here. Go back over here. When I want to make my boss laugh, I talk to her in my mother's voice. Day of the Dead was $1.99. I was so close. And now they are $1.98. I, I called it. Christmas press on nails oval snowmen want they are now 179. I paid 198. I did get a price adjustment on those. Good. All right, I can't believe this, but there's another diamond painting in here. How many diamond paintings do I have to have? This is a girl like a skeleton girl. I thought she'd be good for the Christmas season. I'll show you. At least I've pinned down kind of what two orders I'm dealing with now. So I can jump back and forth. Not physically. That would be exhausting. 448. And she looks like this. Get her out of the glare. Stop it. So, kind of cool. Not just kind of cool, really cool. I like the colors in it. I paid $4.04 for her. The next thing in here is a set of locked hangers, which I am not going to open, but you know what hangers look like, and they are, and it's a set of Wow, how many are there? And they're blocked. No wire hangers! And let's see if they were in this order. Or if I have to actually jump somewhere back around. So what have you guys been doing today? I've just been lying in bed watching pe people on YouTube. And um, 
I watch every morning. I wake up and favorites with Laura has usually uploaded a video. So I watched her. I watched Cheryl over on Are We There Yet? I watched her this morning. I watched Gigi. I, I had to catch up on one of her videos. Her channel is still awesome. Still awesome. And I watched um, Holler Time. And congrats to her. She just got accepted as a YouTube partner. And also as a Timu influencer, she's in the process of applying for. So let's give her a lot of support. Okay, I paid $10.23 for a pack of these 10 flocked hangers. So it comes to about a dollar a hanger. Hmm. Hmm. Now they are $8.36 and you can get them in pink. Why didn't I get them in pink? Oh, well. Jump on that. Eight bucks for ten, ten nice, really, really nice hangers. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay, that's not in this order. This or <laughs> this button made me laugh. It says cried but did the thing anyway. Cried but did the thing anyway. You know what? That is the story of my life. That's kind of me. I'll probably, I'm, I'm always sitting out in my car in the parking lot crying about various things, hoping no one will see me. Then I get up and pull myself together and I do the thing anyway. And I do it well, if I do say so myself. Sometimes you just need a good cry. I don't know where that button is, you guys. Here's a button, but I don't think it's the right button. Cried, but did the thing anyway. 178. And now it is sold out. A lot of people are out there crying, you guys. But doing the thing anyway. Okay, this is... A brassiere. Now, we've already shown this brassiere on this channel. But I had to get it in a larger size. I got it in XL because what it is, is it's just, but it, somebody asked me if I knew any good wireless bras on Timu and I will say that, um, I like this one a lot. It's got these big supportive straps and you pull it on. It's really, really comfortable. Meaning if you're like me and you like to hold the girls kind of like in place while you sleep, if you like sleeping bras, um, this is a good one. It's got padded insides but they're not like padded like padded padded so I got that again uh last time I got it in L and then I realized I needed an XL y'all all right so how much did that thing cost uh, my voice is getting all raspy that thing cost three dollars and 87 cents now it's two dollars and thirty seven cents. That's crazy. Two two bucks for a solid they call it a push up bra, but I don't think it pushes anything up. Push up bra, comfy and light. Okay. What else? Oh no. I bought this again. I'm a delight. It's that I'm a Delight sweatshirt, which I'm wearing now in gray sweatshirt color. And the only reason I'm saying, oh no, I love the I'm a Delight. I think it's hilarious because half the time I'm not. But I don't like the insides of these. They're scratchy. They feel scratchy. Yeah, there's nothing different about the one in this color, but sure, I'm a Delight cheese for a thumbnail cover up my face because i don't ooh, why does my eyebrow look red hello smize all right smize that means smile with your eyes i learned that from tyra banks on america's next top model remember that show all right i don't know if that thing is in this order this is so, it is annoying even me if it's annoying you having to go back from order to order. 
All right, now I've got two I'm a Delight sweatshirts, and that was $10.79, and it is still $10.79. See, what I like about the way I do it on my phone is that I can tell you what the price was when I paid for it, which I don't really think anybody cares, and I can tell you what the price is now. So take that, people who tell me I should have all the prices pre-written down on the packages when I take them out of the bag. No, because that doesn't help anybody. It doesn't tell anybody what the price is now. What is all this stuff? Okay, I'm trying to find just one more thing in this order. Oh my gosh. This is actually a framed picture, you guys. It is a canvas on a... It's a black cat. But it is framed. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's mounted is what I'm trying to say. Cool. Oh, it reminds me of my Felix. Where am I going to hang it? I don't know. With all my other wall art. What did I pay for that? And how did I know that it was already mounted? Mounted. I paid... Let me just put some dead air in this video. Is it here? <laughs> Where is it? The pressure. One piece wooden framed canvas painting, $7.48, and it is still $7.48. Wow, it's the first time I've ever seen anything on Timu that's framed. Or I say mounted, they say framed, whatever. Okay, the next thing here, there are a lot of clothes and I'm trying to get... I'm just trying to see what else is in here besides clothes. Before I start taking out clothes. Oh, here's another autumn leaf necklace, except it's a drop down. I'm ready to wear these autumn leaf jewel. Oh, where are my scissors? Okay, so the rest of this order must be in that other box in the hall. Holy cow. What if none of those orders were my Timu sponsored hauls? I'm shopping too much. Okay, it's pretty. It's a neck. Okay. It hangs down, which I think is really pretty. Well, it kind of goes around. So, like, here's how it goes. See how I'm holding it? So, it kind of goes around your neck and then down. That's gorgeous. Just gorgeous. I bet it was only, like, two bucks. Yeah, a lot of stuff is missing that I want in this order that I don't see. And there's a lot of stuff. I'm so confused. There it is. $3.41. And now it is sold out. I will hit notify me. Oh, there's a really cute one. Stop it. Don't look. All right. What else is in here? Uh-oh, here comes Loki. Here is something that has been shrink-wrapped. Now, Loki... What are you doing? You want to say hi? Pick him up. Here, I got to pick him up because he's too small. Hello? Uh-oh. No. No. Oh. No. No. Okay. Loki, no. He knows the word no. And he knows the words get down. And he knows the words, oh my gosh, Loki, no! He knows that too. All right, let's cut this open. I know what it is, and I'm excited about this little plushie. It is Pac-Man. Now, you should never smush Pac-Man Oh my gosh, because his mouth, you guys, is not, like, 
it's going to take a while. He come, even comes with a little suction cup in case you want to hang him up. Now, is he ever going to be in the Pac-Man shape after he's been smushed like this? I have no idea, you guys. He's a sad resemblance to what he really should look like. I mean, he's kind of getting there. I'm getting in there. Cheese. Hey, look at my Timu haul. It's Pac-Man. Yay! I should get the cat in here, huh? Look what I got in my Timu haul. A little cat. Whoops. You know what I really want to do is put this Pac-Man in the hand. But I want to... <clears throat> His mouth is too... Okay, be very careful. Loki, here, play with this. Loki, what are you what are you doing down there? Oh, he's a little big for the hand. I don't know. Let me know if you like the little black cat better or the hand. I kind of like the black cat better in there. Pac-Man kind of can't tell what that is. And he's kind of getting cramp in the other hand style. So many little hands on my wall. All right, I'm going to take him out. I had originally bought him to put in the hand. I'm going to put the black cat back in there. Mm, okay, that's better. Hey, Loki, play with this. I feel like, I really feel like I have a little toddler, you guys. I mean, he is. He, someone that would, did I already say someone asked me how old he was? I think he's about four months, but I'm not sure. Four months old or something. I don't know. I, I'm trying to find Pac Man now. Lord, that must mean all the other stuff that I really want is in the other box. And I really have to do that robot, that cat robot. That I keep talking about. I paid $6.99 and he is still $6.99. And see, look how fluffy and great he looks. Like, mine is never going to look that way. Never. Because he's been smushed in the Timu. Okay, what else is in here? A ring. Oh, I don't need to do this. I can just rip it open. It's a ring. Is it a leaf? Oh, good. Oh, it's not in any of these orders. Okay, good. I love it when I have to find a completely new order. It's a very colorful ring, and I thought it was going to be much, much bigger. Uh oh. <gasps> Don't panic. Will it fit on? I'm engaged. Leave me alone. Um, okay, it's kind of ugly. Not gonna lie. NGL, kind of ugly, especially with those nails. I don't know what I was thinking. What was I thinking? I don't know. Maybe with the right outfit and fingernails. Or maybe not. How much did I pay for it? How much did I pay for it? I'll show you the picture, and it's still ugly in the picture. So, I paid $2.57. Okay, well, I mean, here's the picture, you guys, in my defense, okay? So, the picture looked like that. You know, there's no fancy editing here. I'm sorry. I know I could put it right here. But I like to just, you know, get it out and then upload it. Okay, and then here's the what I got. What I ordered versus what I got. I don't know. There's not enough pink stones. This one has a lot more pink stones in it all the way around. And this one is just... Whatever. It is what it is. Okay, get it off. For a whopping three bucks, two fifty seven. So then I got a cuddly, cuddly sweater. 
Oh, it feels like a big teddy bear. I could go up and give random men big hugs in this and they'd think I was cuddly and fun. $9.39 for just a basic cuddly. Look, I like this color on me. So I know it looks a little bit like your favorite. Somebody skinned one of the Muppets or something to make this is what it looks like. Somebody skinned a Muppet. Which Muppet did you skin to make that? But uh, it's soft and cuddly and I wish I would have worn it like today because I'm freezing. 9.39, is it still there? And it is still 9.39. And in my defense, oh no, never mind. I was going to say, I thought this was the color they were showing and I was like, now hold up. But no, there's um, different colors and I did pick the hot pink one. And then to that point, I also picked, see, oh, it's in another box. Well, forget that. My gosh, that means that that big box that I thought was from Timu, that was my Timu sponsored order. No, that's just more of my own stuff that I paid for with my own money. I got a sweatshirt. Oh, yay. It's got fleece inside of it. And it's XXL. Don't bite my feet. Don't lick my feet. I'm talking to my cat, not a person. Loki, no. Loki, no. It says happy. Clap along if you feel happy because I'm happy. And I need a sweatshirt to remind me and tell the whole world that I'm happy. Look how high up I'm having to reach to put these things. I'm not doing this. There's a big pile this big of Timu stuff next to me. Hell no, I'm not swinging the camera around to show you guys. Okay, where, oh, where is that order? This is just for that person who told me to stop nattering on. Okay, clap along if you feel. Where is happy? Here it is. I paid $9.89. And it is still $9.89. And you can get it in a variety of colors. Like this. I like blue. I'm partial to blue myself. But you can get it in all kinds of colors. Okay, cool. Felix, I mean, Felix. Loki, if you don't stop licking my feet, I'm going to have to kick your cute little mouth. I would never do that to him. But he might scare me one day and bite my foot and... I got a hook. <laughs> Once again, it's another hook. Because apparently there's some sort of internal, I don't know if it was trauma I suffered as a child or what, but something makes me just obsessively buy a bunch of hooks. I just want to hang apparently everything from the wall. So I can't stop buying hooks. So this one is a tape, a cassette tape with a hook. And I can't get it open. I don't feel like opening it. And who knows? It might go in my 7,000 subscriber giveaway box. Okay, what else is in here? Oh. Yay. Ew, they feel horrible. Why, Timu, do they feel wet and clammy? This is an alien pajama set. Now it's going to match my hat. And I got my pin here that was given to me by favorites with Laura. He keeps swinging around. I have to figure out how to get him down, sealed down a little harder. But this alien pajama set comes with alien sh um, pajama bottoms in pink. They're all right, you guys. I mean, they could be shinier. They're not as shiny as those Hall those Halloween ones from yesterday. So there's that, at least. They've got a little bit of softness in them. A little bit. And they are 97% polyester and 3% elastane. So it comes with these little alien pajama bottoms. And then it comes with some matching alien shorts, which there's no way... I'm going to wear these. These are too short. I don't want my cellulite out there like that. Even to, in bed. You never know who you're going to run into in your dreams. 
Okay, it comes with shorts and then it comes with this little alien t-shirt and it's short and shiny. It's a short, shiny t-shirt, but I might wear it to the, depending on where it falls, I might wear it to the festival next weekend, the fall festival in the 95 degree heat. Hold it up for maybe a thumbnail. Cheese. Okay. What did I pay for that alien pajama set? I paid $12.99 and it is still $12.99. It's cute. I like it a lot. Then there are some earrings and they are nice, I think. Well, they weren't even on the card. They are crosses on a gold hoop, but they hook through your ears up here and then they hang down. Um, so sure, I like them. Where'd the other one go? I mean, you, if you wore these, you'd have to wear just a simple like chain or no necklace at all. I mean, they're a lot, they're a lot. So, I mean, don't overdo your jewelry and wear like a big, you know, attention grabbing necklace with those things as well, or you'll just look like a hot mess. That's my personal advice, but you do whatever you want. Okay, there's also another necklace, and oh, it's a Hello Kitty. Oh, wait, what did I pay for those earrings? I paid. One thirty seven, and they are still one thirty seven. This thing says one pair of men's retro turquoise earrings. I don't understand you, Timu. I mean, sure, men can wear those, but really, that you're gonna just call them men? Just call them earrings. Don't don't gender, don't force them into some kind of a gender box. How about that? That sounded woke. All right. All right, this is a Hello Kitty necklace because I'm really 12 years old. I'm not even going to lie. I didn't get it for my niece. I got it because I liked it and I wanted to wear a sparkly Hello Kitty around my neck. And if anyone has a problem with it, you can just go buy yourself something mature and feel smug. Okay, I paid... Hello Kitty was $5.97. And now she's five ninety eight, silvery crystals, and it says female charms, rhinestone goth, <laughs> goth. Okay, and they do have the Sanrio logo up there and everything. So I don't know if it's an official product or I don't think it is because it just came in a bag. Like it didn't come with a. I don't know. You know what? Let's not question it. There's one thing left in this box, and then I got a bag behind me. Oh, wait. There are two things. There are three things left in this box. This one is a yellow ring that's supposed to look like citrine. I mean, it's not, it's not real citrine. Am I retaining too much water? And it's really yellow for those days when I just want to wear some kind of yellow. <laughs> I don't know. I thought it was going to be big. I thought it was going to be big and eye-catching. And is it in the... Uh, is it in this order? Hold on. I almost closed the whole app, which would have not been fun. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in this order. I 
I just went crazy. Oh, that tape, cassette tape hook. I paid $1.79 for it. This ring, exaggerated ring, silver plated, $187. It's still $187. Here's the ring I got. Here's the picture of it. See, look at the picture of it. Now, come on. On that picture, it looks like it's taking up three fingers. And here, it just takes up one. Do you see? I want my money back, Timu. I want my money back. I wanted a ring this big. I knew there was some... I knew I wouldn't have bought just a plain, small, yellow ring like this. Although, you know, it's fine. There's nothing that wrong with it. But it, I this is not... But... I'm just speechless with the shenanigans going on in the photoshopping. This is a necklace that also looks way smaller than it did in the photo. No, it doesn't. Fine. It looks perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. And the thing is, I bought it twice. So if you like it. It might be in my 7,000 subscriber giveaway box if I ever get to a 1,000. Um, I almost said spiders <laughs> subscribers, but it's got moons and, uh, you know, moons and stars hanging off of it. Nice. I'm afraid to try to put it on because I'm afraid a fingernail is going to pop off. I know I did predict that a fingernail would pop off during this video, but... I don't really want it to happen, so I'm not trying to manif oops. I'm not trying to manifest it or anything. That was a dollar eighty-eight, and it's still a dollar eighty-eight. And I kind of wish I would have gotten it in silver, but it only comes in gold, so not my fault. Okay, finally there is what is this? Now look, for real, I don't remember ordering this. It's another alien pajama set. Because the pink one was just not enough. And it comes with a little tiny alien t-shirt. And he's, you know, saying hey. And then it comes with some alien pajama pants, which are great. I got them in XL and they are somewhat soft. Good because look how high I have to reach. I'm wearing right now. Can I get my leg up? Can I get my leg up? I'm wearing these alien pajama bottoms. And they do get softer every time you wash them. And they are about the same kind of material. Okay, is that, that's it for this box. Oh gosh, is everything leaning on it? No. Oh, turn it upside down. Okay, nothing. Okay, put it down here. Okay, now we're doing this. We are at 53 minutes and then some. Let's see what this is. This is something really weird, I think, you guys. It just fascinated me. Yeah, I thought this was so trippy. looking it is another framed piece of art and it is a skeleton moth look at that that's fabulous <gasps> shocked i can't make a shocked face this is gonna be my thumbnail wow stop trying to smile so hard cheese I need some Botox in my eyes. Everybody say Botox. Botox. 
All right. Anyway, look at it. I don't even know, you guys. I don't know. I just wanted it. I'm going to hang it. I'm going to hang it. Should I replace the hello sign and hang that creepy little dude on there? And it's made out of, um, well, the frame, of course, is wood. And I have no idea what this pinned moth is made out of. But this is the trippiest thing I think I've seen on Timu in a long time. Oh, this is my light back. Loki knocked it over. The trippiest thing I've seen on Timu in a really long time. It's just, I can't stop looking at it. How much did I pay for that thing? $42.90. I'm just joking. I paid $9.98 and it is still $9.98. And wow, it is creepy looking. It's delightfully creepy. Okay, the next thing in here. Um, there are a lot of boxes in here. Don't fall off. These are shoes, I hope. Oh man, I just really hurt myself. Alexa, what time is it? It's 1.32 p.m. Feels like five. These are little loafers and I did not know that the bows on them were this, um, were lined in cheesy little chains. I thought that this, first of all, I thought the bows were leather. And I thought this was just like um, a piped leather, but no, they're chains and I might send them back. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below, send them back. They're just little, cause I just needed something to throw on with black pants at work. But these are kind of like, it's just this part. Maybe I could take this off. Because they'd be cute without this chain. But then I'm pretty sure you'd see the glue. They'll probably fall off on their own anyway. Okay. These are not in this order. And they are... My nose is getting really stuffed up. What did I pay for those? I only paid $27.39. Holy cow. Okay, see... In the photo, you can't really tell those are chains. So I didn't think they were chains. I don't know what I thought they were, but I definitely didn't think they were gold. Like, especially when you look at them, like, in this picture right here. Like, it totally does not look like they've got big gold chains on them. I don't know. Today's like a weird day with Timu. I feel like I'm getting just ripped off left and right by their photography skills. It's about to rain. All right, what is this? $27.39. I think I was thinking, well, if I got them at DSW Shoe Warehouse, they'd be a lot more. I don't know what I got that would require styrofoam. <clears throat> oh, I hate it. I did not get another mug. I'm done with mugs. I'm done with bag. Oh, I'm not done with bags. Oh, we hate the sound. It's a dragon, and it's really cool. Do you like how none of my things are utilitarian? Like, it's, I watch other haulers, and all their stuff is like kitchen stuff you can use and stuff, and mine's just a bunch of basically toys. 
but this is fantastic. Look at that. That's fabulous. It's a, he's an, he's a steampunk dragon. Right on. That's going right next to my balloon dog. I'm running out of places to put things. What did I pay for steampunk dragon? Oh, I got to get that back in there. Just forget it. Just forget it. I'm going to be trapped on this bed, not being able to even get off the bed because of all this Timu stuff all around me. I got to figure out what order that was in and figure out what I paid for it. Let's all have a moment of silence. Where are my watch bands? They must be in that box, the other box that I'm not opening today. Okay, I found the dragon. I paid 9.35 and now it is 10.79. And you can choose between a dragon, a Dachshund, a weenie dog, a rhinoceros, or a steampunk snail, which is kind of cute. <laughs> they are steampunk animals, industrial, gothic, steampunk, sausage dog. I got the dragon. I'm really excited about that in a childlike way. And finally, there's one last box in here. And it is more styrofoam. I don't know what it is, but I know that this probably means there's styrofoam in it. Every morning is like Christmas morning when you got Timu. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys. If you haven't shopped on Timu yet, why not? Check it out. If you have, if you don't even have the app, please use the link in my description below to download it. That, I get five bucks for every new user who uses my link to download their app. So that's exciting for me. Five bucks. I mean, that's a coffee. That's a cheeseburger. That's something. And you get a promo code that's down there too that you can use for the first time. If you're, I'm sorry, if you're a first time user, it will give you 50% off your order, which I would give anything for a coupon like that. I mean, I'd go nuts. This is a jewelry box that I specifically bought to put my Timu jewelry in. Just Timu jewelry to separate it from my other jewelry. So it's just a three drawer jewelry box with different little, okay, this is a full drawer and this has compartments. This looks a little raggedy, like it's been through some things, but I'll fix it later. And I think I paid $11 for this, if I'm remembering. I can try to find it. That's the last thing in that box, you guys. I mean, in that bag. Oh, wait, there it is. I paid $10.87. I was close. And now it's $12.49. But I'm looking forward to putting all my stuff in there. Because I've got jewel jewelry everywhere. All right. Anything? No. That was fun. Another hour long haul for the people who like the long hauls. Now we know that one box plus one bag equals about an hour. All right, next video is probably going to be an infomercial, but it's a really cool gadget. I just have to, I'm a little intimidated by it. It's so high tech. It is a robot that plays with your cat, films your cat, sends you clips of your cat playing to your phone, feeds your cat, tracks your cat, lets you know where in the house your cat is. It does all this stuff, you guys. It's crazy. 
So that's going to be my next video. I'm sorry this has been slanted the whole time. Just low production value over here. But if you watch this whole thing, thank you so much for watching. And if you hit the like button, thank you so much for hitting the like button. And if you endured the ads, thank you so much for enduring the ads. And what else do I need to just thank you for being here. I love and appreciate all of you guys so much. And just thank you for your kind comments down below. I will talk to you soon, probably tomorrow, maybe later tonight. I don't know. All right. I love you guys. How do I stop this thing?